breaking news overnight. A man rushed to the hospital after a deputy involved shooting in the villages. Now we're pressing the sheriff's office for answers about what led up to them opening fire. This is unfolding at the Circle K on Southeast Highway 42, just west of US 27. Let's get over to Justin Campbell, who was the first reporter there. What are deputies saying, Justin? Yeah, Bridget, we're learning just a little bit more by hour by hour, but they will have a news conference at 930 where they will tell us a lot more about what happened late last night. Here's what I can tell you. The deputy was not injured in this deputy involved shooting, but the person, a man was hurt, taken to the hospital. I've just confirmed through law enforcement that that person was not an employee here at the Circle K, but to let you look behind me here, you can see it's still an active scene. Uh, there's evidence markers. There's also some shell casings uh, on the ground. We'll roll some video uh, a little bit more about what we know. We don't know exactly what led up to this confrontation. Um, we know that deputy uh, and the man that was hurt, he was injured. He was taken to a local area hospital, but the deputy, as I said earlier, not injured at all. Now, I've been here for several hours since early this morning after it happened late last night. There is a blue truck with its doors open that... Uh, investigators are looking at along with a white car that crime scene technician technicians have been focusing on. Uh, I'm told this investigation, it will be long, it will be lengthy. They've been here for a long time. And this morning, we will get an update at nine o'clock from the sheriff's office about more about what happened. So once we learn that, we'll pass that information along to you on air and at clickorlando.com. For now, we're live this morning here in the villages. Justin Campbell getting results. News 6.